Matt Reeves, the Batman is great. Matt Reeves, the Penguin is somehow even better. But what if Matt Reeves made a spin-off movie of The Green Arrow? Theory time! Warner Brother execs are piling over the many ways they can try to exploit Matt Reeves' amazing movie slash series spinoff, The Batman and the Penguin, since both of them are phenomenal and Colin Farrell deserves an Emmy along with the actress who plays Sophia Falcone. And they're giving Matt Reeves a lot more power and money to create what they are calling the Gothamverse. But honestly, I would want Matt Reeves to kind of go for the stars and try a little bit more than just Batman-centered characters in the Bat family. And a lot of people would want the Batman to be the start of James Gunn's DCU. But now that I think about it, with how Matt Reeves perfectly tackles grounded characters, I actually wouldn't want the Batman to start off this fantastical universe that James Gunn's helming, but instead tackle a more grounded version of DC Comics, a more grounded realistic version of the DCU. As James Gunn did say, all other DC comic movies running concurrently with his own would still technically be part of the DCU, but would be in like another universe parallel to his own, like the multiverse that he calls elsewhere, just like in the comics. So by that term, there's no real red tape that could keep Matt Reeves from tackling other characters beyond Batman focused characters. Which brings me to the point of this video. Because Green Arrow, like most non-powered heroes, vigilantes, or villains, are like Batman, where they are either a great combatant, they're super intelligent, or they just come from a lot of money and can afford a lot of wonderful toys. And I know we all remember the Arrow series, specifically season one and season two that came out on CW that was so awesome and unprecedented for its time that it sparked a whole universe, the Arrowverse, that had The Flash and all these other TV superhero shows. And why was season one and season two that good? Because the showrunner took a page from the Batman in the comics and decided to make a darker, more grounded version of Green Arrow, and it just worked. And unfortunately, Green Arrow hasn't been in the limelight ever since the Arrowverse, now infamously known as the CWverse, fell. And we also know that Green Arrow isn't on the docket to have a movie or show in James Gunn's DCU for a while. We don't even know if he even is going to like focus on Green Arrow. So why not give this grounded Batman-like character to Matt Reeves, who has shown to tell phenomenal grounded Batman-type stories? And that way, it could be the start of Matt Reeves' own DCU, a more grounded, realistic one that if people are getting tired of the fantastical, they can go elsewhere to Matt Reeves' DC movies and have a more realistic change to it. And the way James Gunn's movies could build up to a Justice League movie filled with fantastical characters like Superman, The Flash, Wonder Woman, and etc. You could have Matt Reeves' movies build up to a outsiders movie which could be a team full of grounded characters each with their own unique traits and skills such as the batman the green arrow maybe the huntress catwoman and you know different other characters like Azrael and and who else with no powers that are interesting in the comics that doesn't really get a chance to shine and you know get faded into obscurity because they have no powers you can list those characters down below in the comments as for who I would want to play this Matt Reeves Green Arrow, I would really like if Matt Reeves would hire Austin Butler, you know, give him the Robert Patterson treatment where everyone's just like, ah, I can't see this guy as the Green Arrow. And then as soon as that first trailer drops, everyone's like, something in the way, mm -hmm. just the way it was with Robert Patterson when we first got the look at his suit. So I'm hoping that you know, someone from WB execs sees this and gets the bright idea and, you know, talks to Matt Reeves about it. And, you know, as soon as the Batman part two drops, that's when it's announced that we're also getting a The Green Arrow spinoff movie by Matt Reeves. It would be, it would be just wonderful, honestly. But this was just to present the idea and why it could be sound. Tune in for the video where I talk about where, what a Matt Reeves Green Arrow movie could be like. And comment down below again, what other characters you could see Matt Reeves tackling in a more grounded DCU, um, like his version of a DCU. 
and like share subscribe and follow if you enjoyed this video as well as ring that notification bell so you know when that green arrow uh video drops and without further ado stay great